Scrag the Slaughterer Scrag is the legendary prophet of the Great Moor, also known as the Gore Harvester and the Moor that Walks. Dragging his massive meat pot behind him, attached to his back with a series of painful tearing hooks and chains, Scrag hacks and rips at his enemies in a glorious blood fueled dedication to the Great Moor. In his wake, he leaves a trail of dismembered limbs and body parts, which it is his duty of his gore noblars to retrieve and deposit into his cauldron. Once the head of Slaughtermaster of the tyrant Bron Rock Grinder, Scrag had a dramatic fall in fortune when he accidentally cooked and served up the tyrant's favourite noblar on a platter at a great feast. In a rage, the notoriously bad-tempered tyrant hacked off Scrag's hands and devoured them, cheered on by the drunken ogres at his feast and then banished the Slaughtermaster to the cursed undercaves of the mountain. Scrag was led from the feast in shame, beaten and bloody. As a final punishment, Rockgrinder augured that Scrag's great cauldron be attached to his back by a series of chains and hooks anchored deep in the Slaughtermaster's flesh. Scrag was hurled into the dreaded caverns beneath the mountain, and the way out sealed by a giant boulder. Refusing to despair, Scrag rammed his butcher's implements into his wrist stumps, forming makeshift weapons. Bleeding and bruised, Scrag stumbled ever deeper into the dank labyrinth, dragging his meat pot behind him until, in the pitch darkness, he was set upon by a pack of ravenous gorges. Scrag hacked around him, ripping and cutting countless assailants before he came face to face with a grotesque, hulking creature that ruled over the other gorges. Scrag ripped the foul creature's throat out with his teeth. The other gorges backed away from Scrag, respecting him as one of their own. Driven by visions of bloody revenge, Scrag led his gorges up into the mountain until they surfaced in the dead of night deep within the moor pit of Rock Grinder. Emerging in a frenzy, he led his gorges in a grand feast dedicated to his god, ripping apart and consuming every ogre present. Rock Grinder himself was pulled apart and boiled in Scrag's meat pot as an offering to the Great Moor. As he made this dedication, Scrag felt his body and wounds knit together as powerful energies surged through his body. Having emerged from the Moor Pit to devour his foes, Scrag is regarded with awe and fear by even the most terrible of tyrants, who see him as the living embodiment of their god. His gorges remain his ever-present guardians, shadowing him wherever he goes, for by following his familiar scent, they are guaranteed fresh kills to feed their insatiable appetites, and as such they revere him as their saviour. When Scrag feeds his moor cauldron with bloody meat, he is rewarded with tremendous powers, making him nearly unstoppable and able to withstand the most severe of wounds. It is only once the battle has ended and there are none left to slaughter, that his power diminishes and the chains to his cauldron fall slack. Within days, however, visions drive him onwards to satiate his god's hunger, and so Scrag must once again seek battle.